This video content is not intended for children. Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. Once again, I'm over here at the log because it's the only place I can find fish right now. It feels like all the stock trout have been fished out, so I'm stuck with bluegill. Maybe I'll get lucky and catch something else. Anyway, let's get started. I got some gulp minnows. Let's see what I can catch. We're gonna start with a float rig. I'm gonna fish it about five feet deep. I do still have some night crawlers left, but I'm fishing with gulp minnows so that hopefully I can filter out some of the smaller fish. Last time I came out, I fished with the night crawlers. All I caught were three, four, five inch bluegill. And hopefully this time I can get something a little bit larger than that. Once again, I'm fishing that Mach 2. This is a lose. Got it on sale for 15 bucks. I wanna try and steer clear of the snags today. Did I get them? I got them. Just a little guy. Even them small bluegill will go for the gulp minnow. Wow, this guy's ice cold. Check him out, four inch bluegill. Check my bait, make sure it's on there nice and straight. Yeah, pretty good, a little bit curled up. We're gonna straighten it up just a bit. It's been a while since I caught a crappie out here. I don't think I'll get one today, but I'm gonna be hopeful. There's a bite. Holy cow, I gotta put my hood up, it's getting too windy. All right, we're gonna get a little dangerous now, fish in the snag zone. I'm not getting any bites. Please don't snag, please don't snag. Got him. Second fish of the day. Another four inch bluegill. Ugh. Just ain't a whole lot going on right now. But I'm happy to be out here catching something. Look at this little guy. Damn airplanes. All right, that's two bluegill so far. Let's keep going. This is Slash Gills from the Juggalo Fishing Posse, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. cold. Holy f Is that a bite or a snag? Fish. All right. Feels like a little bit better of a fish here. All right, a crappie. Hells yeah. Not just any old crappie. Black nose crappie. Check him out. See that stripe up his back? Got a little Charlie Chaplin mustache. Not very big. About an eight inch crappie here. Easy. I'll let you go. Scram. Well, that was a pleasant surprise. I started out the trip talking about crappie and how I haven't got one for a while. Nice little bonus fish. Damn this wind. Got him. What do we got? Bluegill. That's the biggest bluegill so far. Not very big, but it is the biggest. Got about a six inch bluegill here. 
Gulp minnow putting in the work. Got a few small bluegill, a medium bluegill, and one uh, eight inch crappie. They're not really slamming it this morning, so you gotta watch that bobber carefully for changes in behavior. Not necessarily just going under. It's not really doing that. Fish. There we go, another fish on. Another crappie. Sweet. That's crappie number two. There we go. Got a small black crappie here. A little bit smaller than that other one. About seven inches. Let's let it go. Hey, it's Josh from the One Ton Fishing Club. Hi, it's Jared from One Ton Fishing Club. Hey, what's up? This is Kyle from One Ton Fishing Club. Hey, this is Art from One Ton Fishing Club. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. All right, that's two crappie now, and I don't know, four or five bluegill. My hands are freezing, my nose is running, but I'm just happy to be catching something, especially crappie. Fish. Feels like a good one. Another crappie. I'm on the crappie now. It's my third one. Yeah, close to the same size as the other ones. Seven or eight inch crappie here. Awesome. He's so cold, he doesn't even know what to do. This water is cold, it's like 41 degrees. Now that is awesome. Three crappie out here at the log. Oh, my hands are so cold. There's a bite. Ooh, he let go. Well, my face and hands are just about frozen, so I'm only going to stay for a few more minutes. Hopefully I can get one or two more. I'd love another crappie. There's a nibble. Oh, I had a bite. Something kind of small, I think. Grab the tail. Let's get back out there. Come on, one more. I'm really cutting it close now. It's time to go. Wow, this bite has really shut down after I got those crappie. I don't know that I've got another bite since. Just one more and I can get out of here and thaw out my hands. Come on, one more. Just one more fish. I guess they've gotten wise. Or I caught them all. Hello, this is John in the UK. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Come on, one more. There's a bite. Oh, I had him for a second. That felt like a crappie too. Let's get it back over there. Come on. 
Come on, one more. Got him. That feels like a good fish. Oh yeah, that's the best one so far today. There we go, got a nice crappie here. Let's check him out. Easy fella. Easy fella. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Compared to my hand, right? Yeah, that's a good one. I would say we got about a nine inch crappie here. Got him again on that gulp minnow. Let's let him go. Well, that was totally awesome. Biggest fish of the day right there. Makes me want to cast out and try it again. Even though I gotta go. Come on, one more. I'm gonna stay for three more minutes. That's not where I want it. We're gonna redo that. That's gonna keep me here, frozen hands and all. What an awesome fish to end off on. I gotta take my float off. Let's get up out of here and get warmed up. Well, that was actually pretty awesome. I expected results similar to last time. You know, a bunch of small bluegill. But I was pleasantly surprised and caught a handful of crappie. And a pretty good one in there too. Winter fishing can be a chore, you might freeze, but hey, when you're catching crappie and bluegill, it's totally worth it. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.